up. Right, shall we finish the setting up? Okay. Okay, so we'll go for our top. No, we'll go for middle, middle of middle of left plate of left um, paper. Middle of middle left. Ready when you are. <laughs> Bottom left. Top of the square. Right, over there. Top of the square. Okay, so what do we got? That's going to be up by four, and it's going to be across by two. We got to do it, guys. You ready? Yep. Yeah, just verify that. Okay. Okay, we'll go into um, the right top box. Okay. Just a little yeah. left and high. Top left corner. Got a little friend sitting on the frame. Yeah. Ready? Yes. Three o'clock on the square. Good shot. Just touching. I, I flinched on that, but okay, so it's so got half a minute. Okay. To go to the left, and then that should be. Now we've got to go half a minute right, don't we? Correct. Yep. So a little, shooting a little to the left. Yep. So this is obviously new in the chassis too, so it's probably settling in a little bit. Yeah. But. And I guess we might even have to re-zero it down the track. Do you no, I shouldn't need re-zero. Okay. But that's the why the group isn't quite as good as we can shoot with this. Yeah. Okay, last one of just to verify as long as it hits where it should do. Okay. Same square. No, I think I'll go across. Yep, tell me. Uh, to the other side, the full left one. What's that noise? Oh, it's me. It's this bloody, the foam cheek breast was bloody messing around on my chin. <laughs> okay.
So that looks pretty close to spot on. <laughs> Good shot. Okay, yeah, so spot on. let's go to a thousand and hit just that plate, eh? Adjust this camera. Yep. Um, what was the temperature? Okay, so we'll, that's, by the looks of that wind, what do we got, about three? Uh, three to four, actually. Okay, so I'm going to go for two minutes of wind. Okay. That's 28.5, just suits the weather. It's actually one and a half minutes of wind, because we've got half a minute for spin and Coriolis. Okay. So let's see what this does. Right, ready. Right plate, right edge of plate. Not a bad height. Yeah. I'm just going to put another one in this right in the middle, see if it where it goes. Okay. Oh, that's a decent group, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so my wind is just. What is that? I need to come across six inches, that's half a minute. Right. Oh, Just you're the wrong place. way. Oh, Silly okay. Bugger. Good height, three o'clock. Uh -huh. Just off a good height. I just went the wrong way. Oh. I'm not used to using my Cytron scope with the backwards numbers. Oh, okay. Okay. No, well, listen, that's all pretty easy. That's just a thousand. Let's go. Let's try the 1800, eh? That's shooting nicely. It is, that's Fortunate, zoom back out. Got ten power set we got. Right, one, two, three, four. Okay, that should do. So what do we got? Five, five. That's twenty-five down there. Okay. Now we're just going to have to see. Okay, mate. So that's 1800 yards, give or take a yard or two. Yep, sure is. Okay, let's see where it goes, Sam. Ready when you are. In front. Right. Nice and straight. Just to the little left, so it's like just off each of target and one and a half targets low. Excellent. Okay, just 
traffic on the highway, it's okay. <laughs> left and uh, uh, like one take to left about 10 o'clock off edge of plate. So okay. a good height, trying to get tall but So that was pretty good height. Yeah, it was, mate. So we're a little bit left. Yep. good yeah I'm using a lot of holdover okay um, so it's probably we well, still did it pretty easy didn't it yeah no, that's awesome oh uh, we might run another four and Send another few down there yeah okay. see what it's gonna hold like Just off the top edge of plate. Got enough vision I've got it yep. zoomed out to get my hold. You sure can. Okay, yep. Well, I'll try and I'll work it out. I'll pull that out of there so it's not heating up. Okay. <sighs> My hold. What do you want to do? Um, left, left, left. Keeps going left. So we want to go right. One, two. That should be about right. Okay, so where you're holding is just put on the center line is you got your reticle, you got um, five marks, big mark, one, two, right in the middle there, between that one and that one, you're holding right on there, and, okay. and hold the line on it. Okay. Forward. Yep, I'm, I'm just getting a picture of it, mate. So it's pretty much exactly where it is. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm really not sure. Here we okay. go. Set it up well for me, mate. Awesome. Okay. Well, that was good. I think I might leave it at that, eh, mate? Yeah, okay. Um, I just want to do the last couple of shots and yeah, we'll do good a, idea. Just track the video. Okay, well, that was. That's good. Well, I'll do one more and then. Okay. Okay, well that certainly worked well.
Okay, well that one worked really well. Um, this is actually our uh, the 243 that we had in a in the in its factory stock, or it's, it had an Axion um, stock on it the way we bought it, uh, which worked great. But having the spring-loaded rear to it, we found it was just a little bit. It would shoot really well sometimes, and that was a little bit irregular. So I chose this gun to go and put a full aluminium chassis on. Um, yeah, this is this is what we've selected. We've made it some modifications to it to suit our um, <laughs> our setup. Um, to shoot in a bag properly. Um, obviously I've got my adjustable bag base which um, which is just you know just really nice for, for doing this sort of stuff. Um, the stock really happy with. Um, there's a couple of bits it's, that I'm going to mess with. It's not quite loading the magazine um, with the bullets in the magazine so I've got to mess around with that but um, I do like my single loading anyway but I am going to sort that out to make it work properly. Um, and also messed around with the stoke with the scope a little bit. You saw at the beginning of the video that we um, just I'd only uh, basically set it up to get my full 75 minutes. It only had 65 minutes in it, um, and in, in a while ago I chose that was all the minutes I wanted. But really, the super long range stuff is what I like doing. So we've stretched it up, and we're actually going to step up from this scope to something with 120 minutes and push even further. But that's what we're doing at the beginning. So I put a new re remounted the scope, put it in this stock, and today was its first day out to have some shots. So I'm um, Really happy, shoots nice, uh, it's nice and adjustable so both of us can use it. Um, yeah, it's really, really nice. Um, I've also put on one of these bolts the, that has the, the nut in the, the spanner in the bottom of it so you can actually pull your scope off with your actual, with the bolt handle. That was just, you know, grinding down the handle and then and then bolting that on, or screwing that on. But um, yeah, she's a nice piece of gear now. Um, I get a few questions and I should show, um, I've got a, I don't know, that's the box that I just used. These are the rounds that we're shooting. They are just a, a 95 grain round. Um, it's the Burger case, um, and we've got our um, the AR2209 powder that we're running in it. But it's the 95 grain bullet, so um, they're doing really well at this sort of range. But they're working nice. Now I'll go and show you that target, as to so you can actually see the, the from the long range perspective. Okay, well that's the 24 inch plate added at 1800 yards. I'll just zoom back in. There we are, right back in. Um, I'll just release this so you get a bit of perspective. Okay, so essentially there it is out there. That's that one we we're just shooting at, the 800 yards. If we come back in, I'll show you over here where we actually came from. Here's the other two targets. There's our piece of cardboard with our 100 yard setup on it. And just out behind there, the other side of that tree, is our 1,000 yard one. Yep, it wants to focus on the tree, surprise, surprise. Anyway, we've got GoPros out of those two, which you should be able to have footage of that. Um, and yeah, that was out with our 243. It's an XLR chassis that's in there. Um, pretty nice looking gun and it shot really well. 